And now, a Zone at 91.3, 91 second movie review. Five, four, three, two, and action! While it doesn't have the greatest track record, I still firmly believe that DC's movie universe is one that's salvageable. Now, do I think Black Adam is the movie that'll save it? Nah, not really. I mean, I'm a huge fan of Dwayne Johnson and find most of his movies entertaining. And I guess that's how I would describe this movie. Black Adam is chock full of action and that made it pretty fun. But for the most part, there's nothing in Black Adam we haven't already seen before in other superhero flicks. So if you're gonna watch this, don't expect a game changer by any stretch. It's a film that focused more on its action set pieces than it did on proper character development. Johnson can be pretty careful charismatic in almost anything he does, but the underdevelopment of the supporting cast tells me that this project was more about stroking the star's ego than it was about telling a well-rounded anti-hero story. Black Adam introduces us to other superheroes and some stood out a lot better than others. I really liked Pierce Brosnan's portrayal of Dr. Fate along with Hawkman played by Aldous Hodge. The two had great on-screen chemistry and I felt a little bit more invested in their characters over the other two side heroes. But what all of them seemed to lack was a proper backstory to strengthen that investment. It felt like true appreciation of these characters characters hinged on prior knowledge of the comics. But if you don't know the comics, you're expected to care about their abilities and backstories through sporadic throwaway lines of dialogue that mostly fall flat. And while I appreciate how DC's latest projects simply drop us into a world of existing superheroes and villains, their biggest challenge will always be in developing characters we care about without making their films four hours long. Black Adam is far from great, but still gets a passing grade because of the entertainment factor. And while it doesn't all out save the DCEU, with The Rock's help, fans can certainly start to smell what this universe is cooking. Cut! That's a wrap!